Welcome to the Borns Gas Discharge Tube Surge Arrestor Product Training Module. This module will provide an overview of the Borns GDT product portfolio. Borns offers a broad and expanding GDT product portfolio, and Borns goal is to match its GDT product line to the ever-changing application, performance, regulatory, and cost requirements of its customers. A GDT is typically placed in the circuit to either divert surge current to ground, common mode, or to a source, differential mode. During normal operation, the GDT has very high impedance, greater than 1 gigohm, so it's virtually invisible to the circuit. When a voltage disturbance reaches the GDT sparkover value, the GDT will switch into a virtual short circuit, known as the arc mode diverting the surge current through the GDT to ground or source, and protecting the equipment. Born's active emission coatings allow the tubes to transition into the arc mode at currents much lower than 500 milliamps. The arc voltage is the voltage rating that is specified as less than 10 volts at 1 amp for Born's GDTs. The GDT will switch back or reset into a high impedance state once there is insufficient voltage or current to keep the device in the arc mode. This is sometimes called the extinguishing voltage, holdover voltage, or impulse reset voltage. This chart shows typical turn performance of the 350 volt 2026 series GDT on a 10 to 1000 microsecond 100 amp surge. The GDT ionizes or conducts within about 1 microsecond after the transient voltage has reached the rated DC breakdown voltage. The GDT rapidly reaches full conduction within nanoseconds after ionization occurs. Please see the Borns application note, First Principles of a Gas Discharge Tube, GDT Primary Protector. For an in-depth discussion of GDT operation at www.borns.com. The core of Born's GDT products have been designed to meet rigorous telecom standards, such as GR-974, GR-1361, and ITU-T standards. In addition to telecom, an expanded line of Born's GDT surge arresters and switching spark gap devices are used in numerous product applications in the industrial, consumer, military aerospace, alternative energy, transportation, low to medium risk medical, and automotive market segments. Borns offers six families of GDT surge arresters and one family of switching spark gap devices. Within each family, there are multiple voltages, packages, and lead form options available to meet a wide range of customer requirements. The premium family is targeted to cost-sensitive telecom and consumer electronics applications with shorter life cycle requirements, typically three to five years. This family provides customers with a wide range of sizes, types, ratings, and voltages needed to address any number of designs and applications. The displayed chart is a quick summary of the Borns Premium GDT family. This family provides customers with more options for matching performance and cost. These GDTs are targeted to address the needs of more cost-sensitive telecom, CPE, and consumer electronics applications. The Long Life family is one of Born's highest performing series of GDTs. These devices in most cases exceed ITU K.12 specifications and are designed for applications requiring high performance and stability over a long deployment life, typically 20 years. The displayed chart is a quick summary of the Born's Long Life GDT family. Particular attention should be paid to max surge and surge life characteristics which meet or exceed those specified in ITU-K.12. The high voltage family of GDT devices is designed to meet the requirements of numerous industrial applications. The high voltage family offers GDTs with DCBD voltages of 800 to 7200 volts in a wide range of axial and surface mount packages. This family of GDTs is well suited for use in surge protective devices, or SPDs. This displayed chart is a quick summary of the Born's high voltage GDT family. This family offers DC breakdown voltages ranging from 800 to 7200 volts in both axial and surface mount versions. The high current family of GDTs is targeted for industrial, telecom, and alternative energy applications requiring a very heavy-duty high current protection device. 
This family of GDTs is also well suited for use in surge protective devices, SPDs. The displayed chart is a quick summary of the Bourne's high current GDT family. This family is targeted for industrial, telecom, and alternative energy applications requiring a very heavy duty high current protection device. Note, the use of GDTs in power networks with low internal resistance can create excessive currents which can exceed the permissible follow-on current through the ignited arrestor. Under this condition, the GDT will no longer extinguish and can reach excessive temperatures. The use of metal oxide varistors connected in series with the GDT is required to limit follow-on current in these types of circuits. The fast-acting family of GDT devices offers improved turn-on characteristics. The result of these improved designs are GDTs with lower spark-over voltages when compared to typical GDTs. The hybrid GDT family typically incorporates multiple technologies into a single device. The result of this integration being improved performance and functionality when compared to a discrete technology. Borns has developed a line of fast-acting GDTs designed specifically for use with the Borns TBU High Speed Protector, or HSP, device. These GDTs are designed to limit high-speed impulse voltages measured at 5 kV 1.2 by 50 microseconds to levels below the TBU HSP Peak Voltage Impulse Rating, or VIMP. Voltages exceeding the TBU HSP VIMP rating can result in damage to the TBU HSP device. The combination of a fast acting GDT and a TBU HSP provides an extremely fast, low energy let through protection solution that is ideal for sensitive and high value electronics that can be damaged by transients. The hybrid GDT family typically incorporates multiple technologies into a single device. The result of this integration being improved performance and functionality when compared to a discrete technology. The Model 2026 MSP device is Born's first product offering within the hybrid GDT family. The Multi-Stage Protector, or MSP, is a hybrid technology design which combines the speed of a solid-state device and the robustness of a GDT device. In addition, the design incorporates a switch-grade fail-short device, making it suitable for applications requiring UL recognition. In the future, Borns plans to add more products to its hybrid family of GDT devices. Borns offers switch-grade fail-short technology for select GDTs. The switch-grade fail-short device is designed to be the most reliable and safest fail-short device on the market. Many GDTs use either a burn-through or solder pellet design, both of which have limitations in supporting significant longer-duration AC power faults at temperature extremes. From Bourne's view, the burn-through design is not as reliable due to residue which may remain as the fail-short activates, possibly causing higher contact resistance and thermal runaway. Borns uses a spring clip with a standoff support in its design for superior thermal protection. In summary, Borns offers a broad and expanding GDT product line designed to meet the changing needs of its customers' applications.